What's up, freaks? We're getting set up for a live follow along at home workout. You don't need any equipment. I'll give you a second to hop on here. As we're going, we're going to be some, some sets up on our feet, some sets down the floor. So I'll be moving the camera as we go. I'll be tilting it down so you can see me on the floor, which will cut off my head, which will be lucky for you because who needs to see this ugly mug for 60 freaking minutes or however long this takes. So we're going to start with getting a warm up in and then I'll explain how the workout's going to go and we're going to kick some ass. We're going to kill some freaking fat here on a whatever day today is. I don't even know. Sunday, Sunday. Sunday's not your day off. Weekends are not time to be off. Crawl from Scranton, PA. What's up? Ready to follow along on a workout. Yes, my voice is a little froggy, a little raspy because we just finished up a four and a half day course called The Project, a 75 hour plus course that we just finished, graduated on Friday night and the voice is not back. But you could get the point. You can hear what I'm saying. So let's get warmed up. We're going to start walking forward with big forward shoulder circles. Then come walk backwards with backward shoulder circles. It's not my birthday today, Crawl. It's actually the Russian's birthday back there with those things stuck on top of her head. My horns. The devil horns. Backward shoulder circles coming back. Forward shoulder circles as you're walking forward. Instagram doesn't want to start. Keep walking forward. Four shoulders walking forward. There we go, now Instagram is up. All right, let's come in and out with the shoulders. Right on my top, right on my bottom. Just flinging the chest open, a chest fling. Loose, strong, getting those shoulders ready to work. While you're still moving your feet, shaking, stepping, moving. And let's catch it for a stretch for one to three seconds. Fling it open, catch the other side for one to three seconds. Fling it back and forth. So you're holding it there for a few seconds. Boom, stretch it, catch it. We're doing a full hour. You need zero equipment for this workout, but it's going to end up kicking your ass. We're going to start off building up progressively. Stretch it. All right, let's go quad stretches. I'm going to back up so you can see it. We're going quad stretch on the right, hold for three seconds. Quad stretch on the left, hold for three seconds. Knee hug, hold for one to three seconds. Other side, one to three seconds. Rotate between those on your own. Quad stretch. Quad stretch. Knee hug. Knee hug. You can walk forward, you can walk backwards. Do what you got to do. K Waldo, what's up? Stretch it. Getting ready to move. First round is going to be very short as we kind of progressively build up. So the first rounds will actually be warm up rounds. We're not going to need to do too much of a warm up here because we're going to get warmed up as the rounds go. So here's how it's going to go. We're going to have one ex start one exercise just for 30 seconds. Let's call it exercise number one. 30 seconds. That's the end of the round. You take a break. Then we add a second exercise. So you'll do exercise one and exercise two. Then take a break. Then we'll repeat exercise one, exercise two. We'll add exercise three, and we'll take a break. It's 30 seconds of each. So each round gets progressively longer by 30 seconds. So by the end, you've done the first exercise 10 times. It's going to 10 full rounds. So the first exercise is just a high plank walk, a push-up walk. So ones that are on the ground is going to move the camera down so you can see. We're going to get 30 seconds on the clock. We're going to start right away. So all you are is in the push-up position, walking side to side. Once we get more than one exercise in, it's going to be 30 seconds on. You'll have a 10 second transition to the next exercise. Right now it's round one. It's just one exercise, 30 seconds, high plank walk or a push up lateral walk. Let's do it. Go. Going in three, two, one, go. And timer, go. Oh God. Oh. The Russian is lucky it's birthday because it would be some hell right now. Hell right now. We're waiting on the timer. We're waiting on the timer before we start. <laughs> we'll leave it. The timer's up, so you're going to hear a bell ringing. It's going to give you warning symbols when the, when the rounds are almost over, when they are done. 30 seconds on. Go. Begin. Go. I don't hear it. Go, begin. 30 seconds. Why do we not hear it? Because you Tyson, oh. lateral walk. Push up walk. So you're right here. Just walk. What are you doing? What? No, no, no. From the end. What are you doing? First you screw up the, now we're gonna go over there and screw up that side. What are you? This is not musical chairs. How are we gonna hold the rounds over if you don't have it on the volume? It is. So we're gonna listen for that. See, that's a warning. That means the time is up. Look at that. That was simple. I'm gonna keep moving this Facebook camera up and down. Instagram is good. So that was round one. Simple. It's a joke. Exercise one, 
30 seconds. Now we're gonna add on exercise two. It's just a squat to a front kick. Squat to a front kick. So we'll repeat exercise one for 30 seconds, 10 second transition, exercise two for 30 seconds, and we're gonna go from there. So let's get set. You don't need a break there, because that was a joke. Starting exercise one again, which three, is push up walk. Two, okay, three, two, one, go. Go, push up walk again. There's our bell. So we're just straight. Our hands are directly under the shoulders. Walking as far as you can, whatever distance you have. You won't try to space, you just change directions. Keep moving side to side. Back straight, abs strong, hips down. Working your chest, your shoulders, your tri, strong core holding you together. Body stiff as a freaking board. There's a warning symbol. Keep moving, boy. Time, so you have 10 seconds in between just a transition. It's gonna be a squat to a front kick. It gives me time to move this damn camera. Squat to front kick. So we're squatting down, front kick right. Squat down, front kick left. Down. Boom. I'm just breaking to this round, go upstairs, get my great time. So you see the exercise. All right. Squat, front kick left. Full squat, bend the knee and extend. Kick it forward. This is only round two. Every round, we progressively add another exercise on. Kick it, squat, pump, abs are strong, head up, chest out. Sit back on the hips and heels. Time, shake it out. Slightly longer a break, no, go get the great thing. Slightly longer of a break, because it's slightly longer round. We're gonna add in exercise three in a second. How are we doing? Hello, everybody, hello. Stay with us, this is gonna be 60 minutes. Workout. Yes, I did them for you so you can have some fun and laugh a little bit. So, 60 minutes. We're progressively adding stuff and the breaks will get a little bit longer, but this is just the beginning. So, stay tuned for 60 minutes. We're gonna have fun. Sunday again is not your day off, it's another activity. We should stay active as active as possible. As possible, right? Because you have a sedentary life. Ready to roll. What, what is going on so, here? I leave. I leave the camera life. for two seconds. What the hell is going on here? And we're talking about like dancing and shit. What is going on? All right. And these, these, these I don't know, these mouse ears or something. All right. So now we're gonna repeat exercise one, which is the high plank walk. Exercise two, which is squat to front kick. Exercise three is gonna be a squat thrust to a jump. So it's a squat thrust. And you jump up in the air. You'll see it as we do it. So we're gonna get rolling. Exercise one is that push-up walk. So in between, we have 10 seconds in between. I'll, I'll change Five, the camera angle. Four, so push-up walk three, on the bell. Two, there one, it is, high plank lateral walk. Go. You're just going side to side right here for 30 seconds. Hips are down, back is straight, abs are strong. Tight chest, shoulders, tries. Opposite arm goes to opposite leg, get in rhythm. Hold it tight. You can go flat on your hands, you can go on your knuckles, whatever works, doesn't matter. I'm gonna crush you against that pole, boy. I'm gonna crush you. Better keep moving. Hips down, back straight, abs strong, tight, straight, strong, stiff, steady. You know we have the squat to front kick coming up. I'm just going to keep changing the angles of the camera so you can see it. Squat to front kick coming up, exercise two. Each round we add an exercise on. Squat, front kick right, squat, kick left, bend the knee and extend. Breathe it out, control down. Right. You're not even on there. Over the leg, guys. Left. Bend and extend. Full squat. Where's the other one? I hear noise inside. Squat and kick. Boom. There it is. Find a rhythm. Push the pace. We're just getting warmed up. We got squat right. thrust to a jump coming up. Squat thrust to a jump coming up. Better get out here. Come on, come on, come on. Right here, right here. Squat thrust to jump. So you can see I'm squat thrusting back, jumping up, down, back, in, up. and jump. And then explode up. You said you were joining this, Midge. You better get your sneakers on and get out of here. No equipment needed. Anyone could do this workout. Squat thrust to jump. Keep pumping it. Keep working. Squeeze them in. Go straight through to the bell. Time. So that was round three. So that was round number three. So now we add on a fourth exercise, 
we just keep building and building on this circuit. And so each round gets longer and longer. Just keep stretching, moving, shaking. In between, you just get ready for the next round. Catch your breath, hydrate in between. Do what you gotta do. Thank you guys, I see messages coming up. Thank you very much, we are on the multi-platform. Thank you for the birthday wishes, yes. All right, how are we doing? Where are we coming from? Randy, Randy, hello, Ray. Oh, I see so many of you, I gotta see this. Freddy, Freddy Fred, hey, awesome. Agnieszka Babiasz, we have some Polish, Polish people, Grażyna, hello, Grażyna Michalska. Mm, my aunt, Ciocia, Steven Carl, yes. Hello, thank you very much for all the birthday wishes. Stay with us, this is gonna be an awesome, awesome eh, workout, full 60 minutes, this is like the birthday celebration, that's what I want. So, are you just watching, are you actually staying with us and exercising? No equipment necessary, just the body weight, but as you know, we adding the exercise as we go along, so these breaks will get a little bit longer, just keep on stretching, staying loose, staying hydrated, of course, I have my pre-workout here. What is, what's in your pre-workout? Right, Write it down what you're putting in what your pre-workout. I keep stepping away, I step away just for half a second. It's, it's, it's a, a, a birthday in Russia, so I, they have a tradition on <laughs> the Russian birthday, they drink lots of vodka. But the thing is, even when it's not their birthday, they find a reason to drink lots of vodka. They say we're drinking because it's Monday. Monday is a very holy day in, in Russia. Or they drink on Tuesday because it's the second day of the week and the second day is very important so you can stay focused. Sure. Then Wednesday, it's halfway through the week so they drink vodka for them. Then it's their birthday, it's flag day, it's squirrel day. It's their <laughs> great grandmother's, niece's, cousin's, goldfish's birthday. So they will find a reason to drink vodka every single day. All right, we're adding in a plank it's walk. A That's going. Squirrel day. All right, would you... By the way, I, I really wanted to have two holes Get in my head to put Get those angry. in, you know? I can't put a head on. Okay, we're doing the next round. Squat walk, plank walk. Come in front of my camera again. All right, so we're starting push up walk. Who's on the, who's on the clock? You said you had the clock ready. Three. Let's do it, so we're starting with a plank walk. Plank, high plank, lateral walk. On the bell. We gotta go. So now we're up to fourth exercise. It means four straight sets, 30 seconds each. Each round, the longer the round, the longer the break. Cause they're just gonna get longer and longer. Hips down, back straight, abs strong. So this one we're adding a plank walk, exercise number four. We'll be going from a low plank to a high plank. So from your forearms up to this position we're in right now, that's on the fourth exercise. So we keep repeating all the exercises we've done and we just add on top of this. Now we have squat to wall, squat to front kick coming up. Squat to front kick. Let's do it. Squat, kick right. Squat, boom, left. Squat, bam. Breathe it out. Whip it, whip it, whip it. Kick that leg up there. Bam. Bend the knee and extend. Deep, full, low squat. And then whip that leg. Pump it out, five seconds. There's the countdown. You have squat thrust to jump. Squat thrust to jump coming up. Squat thrust to jump. Right away, again, exercise four is going to be that plank walk. We go from the forearms up to the push up position. Plank walk. Plank walk. Low plank to high plank. Put it down low. I think you can see me on there. So you're right here on your forearms. Your hand comes off the ground. It touches the ground exactly where your elbow was. Up and down, that's it. Exercise number four. We're going all the way up to 10. Each round, 
It's just going to get harder and harder. Back straight. Ab strong. Hips down. Time. Shake it. Recover. So that was four exercises. We're going to add in exercise number five coming up. It's going to be a reverse lunge to front kick. Just like we did squat to front kick, this one's going to be reverse lunge to front kick. Shake it, stretch it, get ready. So, since there is a lot of hip flexion, make sure that you're stretching your quads. Your quads, I'm going to show you right now, a lower back stretch, really good one. Normally, sometimes you guys just do the crisscross and sit like this on your leg. However, if you're actually going to hold on to something, I have that pole holding on to, don't get some crazy thoughts in there. You're going to sit low and let those arms fully extend. If you're going to sit low, you're going to really stretch that lower back, that glute area. Just try it, but don't hold on to just furniture. Hold on to something that is super stable, that is not going to fall on you. Look how awesome this stretch is. You're going to feel it all the way down. Now, do the other leg. And again, extend your arms, like almost like you hanging off of it, okay? Hang, 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 get out, now, now low. Stretch on both sides, stretch on both sides. So yeah, look, squats, you will feel the squat thrust, hips, glutes, you gotta stretch it. Standing legs slightly bent. You can hold on to the power right here. Stretch your calves because there's a lot of jumping. Toes are up, heel is down. Lean forward. Stretch. Stretch. Hydrates. Yes, the, 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 the vodka mix that I have here, that's exactly what we have right here. It's the pre-workout. It's the Herbalife and Trulene mixed together. Awesome concoction from BCAA to beverage mix to to our truly right, everyday good camera, good energy good. here, right here, Timer mixed set. together. Timer set. set. All right, we're adding a reverse lunge to a front kick. So we're starting with exercise one. We're gonna work now. We're up to at round five. So now it's five straight sets, straight through thirty seconds each. You have thirty seconds on, ten seconds off. Once all five are done, we take a break and we add on exercise number six. We gotta go. Starting with that plank walk. All right, we're starting with that plank walk. I will tell you when to switch. 30 seconds, that high plank lateral walk on your hands, push up position. Going in three, two, one, and begin. Straight across, 30 seconds-ish. Now the 30 seconds in my head. So lucky you. My brain's calibrated a little different from the plan I'm from. Better move, boy. Keep it rolling. Hips down, back straight, I'm strong. Locked in place, tight, solid. Hands are lined up directly under your shoulders. Let's go about five more seconds. Tight, strong, and time. We're going to that squat to front kick coming up. Yeah. Squat to front kick. Yeah. Just keep changing the camera angle for you so you can see it. Squat to front kick, follow along, right in line. Squat to front kick coming up. Going in three, two, one, and go. Squat the front kick. Squat, kick right. Squat, kick left. Bend the knee and extend. Get that foot all the way up in front of your freaking face. Abs are strong the whole way. You're sitting down on your hips and your heels, on your glutes. Strong quads. Ha. Squat. Boom. Get that leg up there. Breathe it out. Get low and bam. Couple more. Deep squat. One more each side. And time. We got squat thrust to jump coming up. Hope you're following along live. On these breaks in between, you need to put down in the bottom. Where are you following along from, whether you're doing it live or on a replay? Let's go. Squat thrust to jump. Go. Squat butt back. Jump up. Squat down. Jump back. Jump in. Up. Down. Back. In. Up, get some air in that jump. 
Get some freaking air. Oh, get up. Explode. This is exercise three out of five for this round. Get up there. Push it. And time. We have the plank walk coming up. Just gonna keep changing this camera angle. So low plank, up to high plank. What are you doing, Tess? Go, go, go. Three, two, one, go. From your forearms, up to the push-up position. Back down low. Alternate which arm comes up first. Plank to high plank. Alternate sides. Back straight. Strong tries. Time. So we're adding in a reverse lunge to a front kick. So we'll start with the right leg first. Right leg first. Step back to a lunge. Kick right. Step back with the left leg lunge. Kick left. Back with the right. Go. Jump in. Get in there. Make it happen. Facebook it cuts us off on the camera angle. Got to be way far away to see the whole body. Boom. Step back to left. Left front. Back to right. Right front kick. This is round five. So round six, we're adding on another exercise. Every round, we add an extra exercise. Boom. Both knees 90 degrees. Bam. One more each side. Boom. And time. We're adding in a crawl out to a jump. You're on break, but I'll show you the exercise. Wide stance, you're gonna crawl all the way out, full push up position, crawl back in, jump up. That's gonna be exercise six on the next round. Shake, recover, stretch, hydrate, do what you gotta do. Get ready for this next round. Crawl out to jump, round six. Keep it loose. Keep shaking. Okay. Stretch those shoulders. Rotate those shoulders. Stretch your quads. Get ready for round number six. Six exercises. Active recovery. Move around. Shake. Stretch. This is round number six. Exercises. 30-ish. Seconds each. 30 how seconds each. Doing? How are you doing? Write it down how you are doing. I am waving to you from Steve's account. Nice. Awesome. Hello, hello, Marianne Veras, Eliana. Salewski sounds like a Polish Let's do it. Round six. Round six. Yes, sir. What are those uh, goggles are outrageous. It's like a, it's, it's like a, a bumblebee like on heroin or something. Did you like that? Let's do it. Starting right. from the top. Exercise one. We're adding on crawl to jump. This will be six exercises. Facebook. I'm gonna keep adjusting your camera so you can see when we're down low. Push up position. Walking side to side. Going in three, Check. two, one. Go. Walk to the side. Back straight. Burn. Now it's all shade. Back straight. This is like a Act project strong. tent. Suck it up. Half. Suck it up. Suck it up. Hips down. Strong chest. Strong shoulders. Strong tries. Keep it tight. Keep rolling. Ha. Ah. 30 seconds. But our timer burned out in the sun. So unfortunately you have to do 30 seconds in my head. Time. Which, who knows? That shit's all fucked up up there. Who knows what's gonna happen? Squat, front kick, coming up, going in three, two, one, and rolling. Squat, front kick, right. Squat, kick left. Get low. Bend and extend on that leg. Bam, get full squat. 
Kick it. Full squat. Kick it. Time. We got squat thrust to jump. Coming up. So it's going to be 30 seconds on. In between exercises, you got 10 seconds. Just to get set up. A half of a stretch to get ready. Going in three, two, one, and go. Squat thrust to jump. Right back down. Pumping it out, squat down, jump back, jump in, jump up. This is exercise three out of six for this round. We're up to round six. Time. We got the plank walk. Going from low plank to high plank. Let's do it. Going through your forearms up to the push up position. Going in three, two, one, go up, high, back down. Keep rolling. Control those steps. Alternate which arm goes first. So one time go right, left. Next time go left, right. Left, right, back down. Right, left, right, left, left, right, left, right. Time. We are up for that reverse lunge to front kick. Alternating sides. Let's roll. Reverse lunge. Right leg steps back. Kick forward right. Left leg steps back. Kick forward left. Reverse lunge, front kick. Lunge, kick. Control down. Boom. Then extend, whip it. Bam. Oh yeah. Now the quads are starting to feel it. We're starting to get there. We're just warming up still. This is only round six. And every round, Gets harder, harder, longer and longer. Time. So we got crawl out to jump coming up. Crawl out to jump. Let's do it. Wide feet, wider than shoulder width. You're gonna crawl out to the push up position. Three, two, one, go. Crawl out, crawl back in, jump up, all the way out, back in, jump. Get up there. So the full push-up position, get some air. Fully extend on that crawl out to where your hands are lined up underneath your shoulders. All the way out there. Get up. Two more. Ha! Oh yeah. And time. Round six. Done. So round seven, we're gonna add shoulder taps from the push-up position. Shoulder taps, just alternating arms. One time I demonstrated this in the air to someone, telling them it's from the push-up position from the high plank. We started the set, and they stood there with their hands in the fucking air and just did this. They thought that was the exercise. So to be clear, we're down the freaking push-up position. Stretch his chest, shoulders, keep them loose. Stretch the quads, shake it, recover, shake prepare. It. How do you shake it? How do you shake it? Tell me how you shake it. What are you, what is going on over there? Every time I step off, just to write the next round on the board, I hear some, I hear some nonsense going on over here about Russian stripper poles and Vodka and dancing and crap. What is going on? This platform's calling me. Be aware. What's calling you and what you're doing here on this platform? Shake it, stretch it, get ready. Nope. Well. We're adding in shoulder taps here from the push up position. Round seven. 
Now this is round seven out of 10. You might think that means you're more than halfway there. That is the furthest thing from the truth. Once you get to round eight, once you start round eight, that's actually the halfway mark. If you count the number of sets, because it's progressive, it's compounding. So think about it, round eight, nine, and 10 together. That's 27 sets in just eight, nine, and 10. The full seven rounds before that, you've done 28 sets. So the, once we get to round eight, that actually is the halfway mark. So don't think, because we're on round seven, that you're already past the halfway, not even close. Because it's heavy, it's back end loaded on this workout. So let's do it, let's get ready. The high plank walk. Let's go, push up position. Going in three, two, one, and go. This is round number seven. Seven exercises. Glide across. Back straight. Hands will line up under your shoulders. Stiff as a board. Straight, strong line. Yeah. Locked. Locked in place. We're going 30-ish. 30-ish seconds. 30 seconds in my head. I'm gonna go back and watch the replay and see how long these seconds, these sets actually were. I'm just judging that it's somewhere around 30 seconds, but who knows? Maybe I'm being a pussy and it's only like 10 seconds, or maybe I'm clueless and it's like two minutes. Time, no clue. We're just stopping when we stop. I got the clueless one. Yeah, you better watch it, boy. Well, you at least you can say the first one. The first one's probably worse, actually. Squat to front kick, going in three, in two, in one, and go. Squat to front kick. Squat to front kick, start. Just keep adjusting the camera so you can see. This doesn't show the full range. Full squat, kick right. Full squat, left. Whip that leg up there. Pump it out, find your own rhythm, go at your own pace. Modify if you need to, you know what you can and can't do. You need to modify it, modify it. Just do a knee right raise if you have to. Just do a partial squat if you have to. Hold on to something to help you get a little lower if you have to. Do what you gotta do. Modify before you stop. Die before you fucking quit. Kick that leg. Boom. One more time. Ah. And time. We got squat thrust to jump coming up. Squat thrust to jump coming up. Keep it rolling, freaks. Keep it rolling. Should not be backing out. Should not be punking out. Should be following along every second of this. Let's do it. Going in three, two, one. Squat thrust to jump. Back, get some air. Down, back, in, and up. Squat down, jump back, jump in, jump up. Smooth, flow. There's no push up. There's no humping the ground. There's no nut ups or gut ups or flinging your hands in the air like a little cheerleader. It's just a squat thrust to a squat jump. That's it. Squat thrust. Squat jump, smooth, controlled, solid work. Let's go, a few more. Last two. Time. All right, we got plank walk. That's going from the low plank up to the high plank. Going in three, two, one. Begin, start low plank, walk it up to high. So the spot that your hand is on the floor, that's where your elbow touches. So you're not just rolling up. That one arm is actually off the ground for a split second. Put your feet as close together as you can, but as far apart as you need to. The further apart, the more help you're gonna have by having a wider foundation. Closer together, the less help you're gonna have with stability. So it's gonna be harder, closer together, a little tiny bit easier if you bring them apart. Working the chest, the shoulders, the tries. Keep it rolling. Ha, ha, and time. Reverse lunge to front kick. Make sure you're controlling those plank walks, not bashing you up on the ground like I just did. Put your live. Let's go. Right leg back for lunge. Kick forward, left leg back, bend, right, and right kick. Left leg back, left kick. So look from a side view, 
So you can see I'm coming to 90 degrees in both knees, whipping that forward. The other side, 90 degrees. So I'm sitting on the hip and the heel. Hip and the heel, the front leg. And then kicking. So step back right, kick right. Step back left, kick left. Let's go, two more side. I don't know if it's 30 seconds. I don't care. We're getting the freaking work. That's what matters. Ha, time. Shoulder taps. Push up position, round seven. This is the first time we're doing the shoulder tap. So this is the end of the round. No, sorry, cross the jump, cross the jump. Good catch, Tyson. He remembers it more than I do. Let's go, crawl out, crawl in, and jump. Lesson right there. If you see something, don't be afraid to speak up. I was ready to skip the crawl out. I just had to get put in check, put in place by a nine year old. Tell me, nope, crawl out, the jump should be next. Not shoulder tap. Sometimes you gotta lead. Sometimes you gotta follow. Only way you can do either one of those is to kill your fucking ego. Kill your emotions. Eliminate the two E's, ego and emotion, so that you can have no problem getting put in check by a freaking nine-year-old. By a sharp as hell nine-year-old telling me what's next on the workout that I created that he's seeing time. He's seeing for the first time right now today, and he's correcting me on it. That's called focus. Let's go. Shoulder taps coming up in three, two, one. So you're gonna push up position. Left hand taps right shoulder. Right hand taps left shoulder. Go at your own pace. 30 seconds nonstop. Try to twist as little as possible. Your back's gonna wanna twist. Don't let it. Keep pumping it. Keep pumping, keep rolling. Go slow, go fast, don't care, just go. Do what you gotta do. If you need to for half a second, you put your knees down. And then you come back up and you attack the freaking set. Five more, four more, three more, two more, one more. Time. And that's the round. That is a round, freak shows. Awesome job. Shake it, stretch it. Hydrate it, recover it. All right, coming up, we're adding in. Would you stop jumping in front of me, please? I was behind. Coming up next. Yeah, knuckles are all screwed up. Good work. This is a, what? Yes, sir. Is that a weakness? Next, we're adding in walking lunges. Forward walking lunges. Set number eight. So right now, we're officially at the halfway mark. Although you think that we already were because this is set eight of 10. Just right now, we're at the halfway mark because it's back end loaded. Shake it, stretch it, stay hydrated, active recovery, stretch your chest, stretch your shoulders, your quads, your hamstrings, your glutes, getting ready for the next round. We're adding in forward walking lunges. Only three rounds to go. They haven't been long as hell rounds, but only three rounds to go. Take the hat off around. Although I can't keep it off too long because this pasty ass bald head will get roasted in the sun. Ah. While we're on this break, put in the comments below, where are you watching this from? Put in if you're watching this live or if you're doing this on the replay, if you're following along. Also make sure you like the video and share it. Click the share button, share it with your friends your family, your coworkers, your fucking enemies, anyone who can use a little fat assassination in their lives, a little stepping up in their mind, in their body, and their nutrition, in their energy, in their discipline. You get disciplined with your workouts, you get disciplined with your nutrition, you do hard shit like this on a Sunday, it sets a tone for the week, it sets a tone for your freaking life, that's what it does. And carries over, the discipline from your workouts and nutrition will carry over into all areas of your life. Next thing you know, you're having better relationships. You are finding more purpose in everything you're doing. You're becoming a better leader, better communicator because you had discipline to start doing things for yourself and leading yourself first before you lead others. Let's get rolling. Round number eight, we're adding forward walking lunges. 
Starting with that high plank lateral walk. Going in three, going in two, one, begin. High plank lateral walk, 30 seconds. What are you doing, boy? Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, getting hot. Ground is getting hot. We'll live. So it could be a lot worse. Sitting here in sunny California, under the palm trees, 80 degrees, in the middle of November, we can handle a little hot ground under our hands. We'll live. We'll survive. It could be a lot worse than this, trust me. Life is good. Appreciate the shit you have. Be grateful for what you have. And time. Up for that squat to a front kick. Squat to front kick coming up. Set exercise two out of eight for this round. Mine. Going in three. <laughs> what was that? No, nowhere. Two. You just pop it nowhere and do the cheerleading clap. Right now. Squat. Front kick right. Yes. Squat. Front kick left. No, this ain't the, the freaking the, 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 the Rockettes and the Christmas Spectacular. The Russian Spectacular. Bend and extend. I got a block. Alternate legs. Full squat. Get down there. Boom. Get low. Oh yeah. Bam. Breathe and kick. And time. Squat thrust to jump. Coming up. Squat thrust to a jump. Don't punk out. Keep rolling. Going in three, two, one, go. Squat thrust, jump. Down, back, in, and jump up. Squat down, jump back, jump in, jump up. Get some air. Oh, yeah. 30 seconds, you should be getting about 12, 12 to 15 of these in in 30 seconds, something like that. At least, this late in the game. Pump it out, pump it out, freak shows. Time! All right, plank walk, we're already down low. Plank walk. Let's go, low plank up to high plank. And begin. Up to push up position. Back down to the forearms. Alternate which side goes first. Right, left, right, left. And then left, right, left, right. Right, left, right, left. Ha, 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 ha. Oh yeah. Couple more. And time. Time. All right. We're on the reverse lunge to a front kick. Reverse lunge, front kick. Coming up. Back with the right leg for a lunge. Right front kick. Back with the left. Boom. Control down. Don't rush these. You don't want to slam on your knees. And put any pressure on that front knee. Make sure you're sitting back on the hip and the heel and the glute of that front leg each time. Not pushing forward onto your toe. Putting pressure on your knee. Ha! Oh yeah. A few more. One more inside. Boom. Time. All right, we got to crawl out to jump. Coming up, crawl out to jump. Going in three, this is exercise six out of eight for this round. Two, one, go. Crawl all the way out, full push up position. Crawl back in, jump up. All the way out, fast hands. Fast hands back in and jump. I ain't gonna keep up with you, little midget. Can't keep up with this freak show next to me. He's already like three reps ahead of me. My long, lanky ass getting all the way out there. Hell no. Full push up position and jump. Oh, yeah. Get out there. Back in. Get up. Ha. Time. All right. Set 
seven. Shoulder taps. Push up position. Woo! Going in three, two, one, go. Alternating arms. Left arm touches right shoulder. Right hand touches left shoulder. Back straight and strong. Solid. Stiff as a board. Locked in place. Breathe. Keep those abs tight. Keep that core tight. Oh yeah. Pump it. Six more. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we are on walking lunges. Forward walking lunges. Going in three, two, one. Time, walking lunges forward. So you step forward, go right into the next step. But look, if you have to, you bring both feet together and reset before you go to the next one, if you have to. If you can, just step into the right next step. We look, if you have to, bring both feet together. Then go with the other leg. Both feet together. Then the other leg. If you can though, go straight forward into the next step. This finishes round eight. We only got two more rounds to go after this. I'm breathing in so much ash, I smell it in my nose. Taste it. Oh yeah. Time! And that's round eight. So we're adding for round nine. Have to take a break. So again, the longer the round, longer the break. So you get a few extra seconds here for this break to recover so we can attack the next freaking set all out. We're adding in exercise nine. Exercise nine is four high knees, alternating with four mountain climbers. So you're up for four high knees, hit the ground, four mountain climbers. High knees, mountain climber. Four total, so that's just two each side. So literally for high knees, that's just one, two, three, four. And then drop down from the mountain climber. Same freaking thing. That's so hot out. Four and four. Ooh. Four and four. Exercise nine. Two rounds to go, freaks. That's only 19 sets. Oh. Even though it's only two rounds. If you do the math, including the time in between exercise, still over 20 minutes left. I'm to you, sir. For those 19 sets. Not over 20 minutes left, but damn near close to it. Because there's 10 minutes of actual sets themselves. They have the 10 seconds in between the 30 second sets. You have the break in between rounds 9 and 10. So we got between 12, 15 minutes left to go. That's it. That's all you got to do right now. Round 9, round 10. We're adding on this round again. Four mountain climbers, four high knees. We'll start with, start with the high knees. Four high knees, four mountain climbers. Four high knees, four mountain climbers. Shake it, stretch it. Get ready for this round. Stretch that chest. Stretch the shoulders. You see that freak show in the background? He was in the back dunking his head in the water. Cooling off. Oh yeah, feeling good. Feeling good. Just set up the ice bath. Just empty out the jacuzzi, get a few hundred pounds of ice and throw it in there and do an ice bath. Like the project freaks just did. Sweating. It's a gift. An ice bath is a gift. People think it's torture and it sucks and they fear it. It's a freaking gift. It's freaking therapeutic to your bones, to your joints, to your muscles, to your aches, to your pains, to your bruises, to your bitch acidness. All right, let's do it. Round nine coming up, freaks. Adjusting our Facebook camera to get low. Push up position. High plank lateral walk. Going in three, two, one. Go! Two rounds to go. Round nine, round ten. Here we are right here. We started with one exercise. We built up to nine. Little spider. Make sure it's not a tick. <laughs> Spiders just spread underneath us. Strong. Keep rolling. Time! Right away, up for that squat to front kick as I adjust the freaking camera. So hot. Shush. Go. Squat. Kick right. 
squat. Ha. Round nine. Nine out of ten. We are chipping away. We're getting there. Get low. No equipment needed. No space needed. So you have no freaking excuse to not be able to get a full workout, a total body workout. We're working your strength. We're working your cardio, your endurance, your durability, your mental toughness, your core, upper body, lower body, the whole damn thing in this workout. With zero equipment, zero space. Time. All right, we got squat thrust to jump. Coming up, squat thrust to jump. Exercise three out of nine for this nine set round. Going in three, two, one, go. You're not out of breath. You're doing something wrong. If you're not dripping sweat, you're doing something wrong. If you're not ready to stop, you're doing something wrong. If you're not just having to mentally push through, you're doing something wrong. Your body should have wanted to quit a long time ago, but your mental toughness, resiliency will not let you. You will endure. You will suck it up. You will not be a little bitch. Time. Plank. Walk. Going from low plank to high plank. Let's do it. Elbows to hands. Going in three, two, one, go. Keep rolling. Let's go, three more. There's one. Ha. There's two. Ha. There's three. Ha. Up. On. Your feet. Reverse lunge to front kick. Let's do it. Going in three, two, one. Lunge back right. Kick right. Lunge back left. Kick left. Let's keep switching sides. Head is up. Chest is out. Abs are strong. When you come down, look at that upper body stays upright. Don't slump forward. Ha. Control down. Resist. Kick. Both knees 90 degrees. Let's keep rolling. Let's go. Two more. Time. Crawl out to jump. Coming up. Set six. Exercise six out of nine for this round. Let's go. Wide stance. Wide the shoulder width. Three, two, one. Go. Crawl out. Full push up position. Back in. Jump right from that bottom position. All the way out there. Keep rolling. All the way out. All the way in. Explode up. From that bottom position, jump. Don't stand up straight and just do some little ankle flip. It's a squat jump from the bottom. Not some bullshit flick in the air that I see you doing on the internet. And I'm freaking YouTube. It's from down here, deep, and get up. We are working full range of motion. No bullshit. One more. One more. Oh yeah. Woo! Ha! All right. Shoulder taps. Shoulder taps. Push up position. Push up position. Three, two, one. Go. Push up position. Taps. We're doing one per second here. Slow, steady pace. 12, 13, 
14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 10 more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. On your feet, freak shows. Walking lunges. Forward walking lunge. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. Both knees 90 degrees, right into the next step. Oh yeah. Whew. Adjust our camera. Keep it rolling, freak shows. Forward walking lunges. Two more. Two more each side. No hands on your legs. Control yourself. Raise your core. Time. All right, we got the four high knees, four mountain climbers, alternating. Boy, him, he's side halfway side. through the pool. Dipping his whole upper body in the pool to cool off. Do what you got to do. Let's go. Four high knees, four mountain climbers. Going in three, two, one. Go, one, two, three, four. Right away, one, two, three, four. Right back up, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Mountain climbers, alternating. Oh yeah. 30 seconds. Let's roll. It's a fast paced set. Finishing off round nine. Jacking up your freaking heart rate. Heart rate should be through the roof. Sweat should be dripping. Should be all slimed out. Breath, deep breaths. Control your breathing. Focus. One more each. And time. Round nine. Complete. Fuck yeah. One more round to go. All we're adding in is 30 seconds of flutter kicks. That's it. Round 10, 10 straight sets. 30 seconds each. Finishing strong. We built up to this spot. Crazy boy. Sweat. This is your sweat. <laughs> Stretch. Wipe your hands. So Recover. Hydrate. One more round. One more freaking round. This is it. All 10. So just a recap of all 10. First, make sure you're liking and sharing this video. Subscribing to this to our channel on YouTube as well. Walking you through all 10. It's gonna be that high plank lateral walk. It's gonna be squat to front kick. Number three, squat thrust to jump. Number four, plank walk. Number five, reverse lunge to front kick. Number six, crawl out to jump. Number seven, shoulder taps. Number eight, forward walking lunges. Number nine, alternating the high knees and the mountain climbers, four and four. And final exercise number 10 is on your back, flutter kicks. 10 straight sets, finishing off round 10, and we are done. Workout complete. Who knows in the comments how many total sets it is? Without Googling that shit, without pulling your little fruit phone calculator or your abacus, who knows how many total sets that is? Because you basically just goes one plus two plus three plus four plus five plus six plus seven plus eight plus nine plus ten. Who knows what that is about cheating? Put in the comments. Shut. Okay, so you just screamed out the answer for them. Free discipline. Oh, I thought. When well, you already know the answer, I've already told you the answer. Slipping over there. Stay to the side. Who knows how many total sets it is? If you didn't hear him give you the cheat code. The cheat code. One plus two plus three plus four plus five plus six plus seven plus eight plus nine plus ten. And it tells you how many sets you have. You need to listen and pay attention. You just don't listen. You don't listen to what's going on. You just battle. Yeah. Clearly told them to do it. And you scream out. Oh, that is. That's your you don't want to show. Oh, I know what it is. You only know what it is. I told you. Yeah. <laughs> Lessons and everything. All right, let's do it. Round number 10. All 10 exercises. Straight through. Going out with a bang. Going in three. In two. One. Begin. High plank, lateral walk. Back 
cross, changing directions, whatever space you have, doesn't matter. Hips down, back straight, strong chest, strong shoulders, strong tries, keep it tight, keep it strong, keep it rolling. You made this all wet and slippery, doesn't it? Time. Squat to front kick. Begin. Squat down. Front kick right. Squat. Boom. Kick left. Squat. Bend that leg and extend. This is your ninth time doing a squat front kick. It's your ninth time. That was your tenth time doing the high plank lateral walk. Whatever round we added it in on, that's how many times we've done it. Control down, kick, all the way down, boom. None of you are reading on camera. Bam. And time. Squat thrust to jump. This is the last set of each of these. Let's do it. Squat thrust. Jump right to it. We need 12 to 15 of these. Keep rolling. Focus on your breathing. Four more. Four more. Last one. Time. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Plank walk coming up. That's low plank to high plank. All the way down there. Going in three, two, one. Begin. Watch those up that and down. You need 10 of these. There's three. Ha. There's four. Ha. There's Five. Six. There's six. We are up. Reverse lunge to the front kick. Let's do it. Oh yeah, you should be dizzy. You should be tired. You should be shot. You should be wobbly. You should be happy. You should be in fucking heaven. Go. Control down. Boom. 90 degrees both. Bend and extend. Same leg that steps back for the lunge. That's one kicking. Whip it. Whip it, keep rolling. Just need to adjust that camera a little bit. Other side. Let's go, two more each. One, one, and two. Ha, two. Crawl out to jump. Coming up. Crawl out to jump. Exercise six. Going to 10 and we're done. Wide stance, begin, crawl all the way out, full push up position, crawl back in, jump up, all the way out, and explode, suck it up, work through it, breathe it out, oh yeah, all the way out there. Get up, get up, get some air. Ha! Ah. Two more. Only four sets to go after this. This is six. Four to go. Time. We are down for shoulder taps. Coming up. Push up position. We need 30 of them. 30 of them. Let's do it. Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen, eighteen, twenty, two, twenty four, twenty six, twenty eight, thirty, twenty thirty, twenty thirty. <laughs> 20, 30. All right, we have walking lunges. Forward, walking lunges coming up. Go right to it. No time in between. 
Let's get this shit over with on a Sunday. And then after this, you should still, after this workout, you should go for a walk, or a jog, or a hike, or a bike ride. Something like that, a swim. Be adding an extra activity on top of this. Some more, a moderate exercise, moderate activity to make the most of your Sunday. Tyson, come on. Fucking cut in front of me. Shoot. Make the most of your weekend. Don't waste your weekend. Make the weekend your freaking weapon. Two more time, Tyson. Let's say you get and end up injuring yourself or someone else. All right, rolling an ankle. One little roll ankle. Time. Four high knees. Four mountain climbers. Last two exercises. Going in three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four. We need ten of each. One, two, three, four. That's one. One, two, three, four. Two. One, two, three, four. Three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Count last, we can all hear you. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five. Is that five? Huh? One, five two, more. Three, four. One, two, three, four, six. Six when we stand up. Freak shows. Okay. Set number 55 on your back. Flutter kicks. 30 seconds. We need a lot of them. Let's go. I don't care what distance, what speed. Modify if you have to. Go. Five, four, six, eight, ten. We're going to 100. 20, 30, 40, halfway there, 60, 70, 80, 100 and we are done freak shows we are done we are freaking done as the kid goes to dip his face in the pool that was progressive rounds starting with exercise one adding another exercise every set 30 seconds each ending up with 10 sets equals or 10 rounds equals 55 freaking sets this is how you need to be training on a sunday find some hard shit to do and when you're done with it go do some more hard shit like after this we're gonna go for either a, a bike ride and a walk a hike and a walk a jog and a walk a jog and a hike we're not done we're gonna go get some yeah i'm not talking here i'm not talking here yeah excellent excellent good good use your weekend as a weapon do not waste your weekend Remember those W's. No wasting of the weekend. Yes, use the weekend as a freaking weapon. Let the rest of the world, pretty much Friday afternoon, think about it. Whole Friday. People waste the whole Friday because they're just thinking that's the end of the week. And they just dial it in. They just sign out. They check out Friday. The whole day working or whatever they're doing. They bullshit on a Friday, which leads them into Friday night. They take the weekend off. So technically, that's like two and a half, three days out of the week. You know, two days out of the week, Saturday and Sunday, is something like 17% of the week or I don't even know, 23% of the week, whatever the hell it is. That's a large percentage of the week to be cashing in. And if you start that mentality on a Friday with the whole TGIF, you see it all over fucking Facebook and Instagram, thank God it's Friday. You should be saying TGI Monday, TGIT, thank God it's Tuesday, TGIW, thank God it's fucking Wednesday, TGIT Part 2, thank God it's Thursday. 
And then, of course, TGIF Friday and SNS for Saturday and Sunday. Thank God it's every fucking day that you're awake, that you're here able to do this shit. Stop bitching and moaning and complaining about bullshit. No matter where you are, shit could always be worse. Don't waste your weekend. Do hard shit on the weekend. Do even harder shit on the weekend. Because you have more probably time. You can focus on it. You can spend the time to recover. You can take more time doing it. Search for hard. Easy is fucking easy. Easy is average. Easy is mediocre. Easy is bullshit. Easy is the bitch way out. Easy is not successful. Easy is broke. It's easy to be broke. It's easy to not have freaking money. It's easy to not be freaking happy. Do the hard shit. Search for hard. Seek for hard all day. Just be on the lookout. Searching and destroying hard shit. Hard is extraordinary. Hard is above average. Hard is excellence. Hard is success. Hard is fucking money. Hard is happiness. Hard is success. That's what you need to freaking think in your head. Anyway, I'll quit babbling because we got some more work to get to. I will talk to you later. You are freaking awesome. No excuses. I'm sure little freak show here has something he wants to tell you. No! Excuse Very, very normal child. I can't imagine where he gets it from. I will talk to you later. You are freaking awesome. No excuses.